what's up guys? Welcome to where are we Baba? Philippines. What island? Uh Surigao. Surigao. I'm having Megan say it because I never seem to be able to say it right. But yeah, we're here on a bit of a media shoot with a friend of mine. But there's a bit of wind today, so we're gonna actually go and scope out the kite spot, which is just a little bit down from where we're staying. First day of wind since we've been here. So yeah, we're just gonna go check it out, see what it's like, and hopefully go for a session at some point. Bruce? So yeah, let's let's go check out the spot. Ew. One, three, five, go! Uh, coming from the wild, wild West Indies. All right, Robert, so give us a little update. We have just gotten to a spot called Bravo, which we believe is where like the kite spot is. So we've just come down this morning to give it a little check. Check it out. It seems like there's a little bit of breeze. So yeah, we just reached here and that's what the plan is. It's beautiful. There's a kite over there, so I'm pretty sure we're in the right spot. <laughs> But yeah, super nice spot. There's like a resort, looks like. And they have a skate park on the entrance. You can see the water. I think they got a big, nice beach. So yeah, let's go see what they got, please. Alrighty, guys. So yeah, we definitely found the kite spot. It's called Bravo. It's like a hotel resort that gives you access to the beach. Nice big beach for launching. The wind's good. And this answers a lot of my concerns I had about kiting here. It's because uh, on the map, the spot looks super duper shallow, but it looks deep enough to like foil and do all that fun stuff. So yeah, they got a good, cool little kite community here. Looks like as well, they got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten kiters out. I think everyone's stoked because I don't think it gets that windy here all the time, but yeah, the wind's on today. So probably get Megan out at some point and myself and show you guys a little bit more of what the spot looks like and how kiting is actually in Bravo in the Philippines. Woo! Wind is still on, sun's still out, and we're gonna go for a little session. I think I'm gonna take the Tona Joyride out today. It's been a little while since I rode straps and I kinda wanna get back into riding straps and just getting back into that style of riding just to switch it up. So that's what we're gonna do today. Kinda show you guys the spot see how many tricks I can do on, on uh, the joyride and just have a little session in paradise views. So yeah, let's go. Ooh. This place is pretty insane. Bravo Beach, I'm not sure if that's the name of the actual beach, but this whole beach, Bravo is kind of where all the kiting happens, is freaking sick. We've been here for like uh, nearly two weeks doing a lot of exploring and a little bit of kiting, but the kiting days that we did get were super good. A few stormy days, but a few days like today, where it's just perfect weather. Um, so yeah, if you ever come into the Philippines, and want to check out Shurgao for some surfing uh, as well as some kiting. It's definitely sick. Um, as I said, the best time to come is from I think November until March, and um, we're like kind of in February now, so we kind of hit it right on the on the head. Um, but yeah, super cool spot, man. Uh, I think that's going to be kind of our showcase of this 
kite spot in Shergal. Hopefully you guys enjoyed tagging along for the sessions. Hopefully you enjoyed seeing the joyride in action. It's been super fun, um, you know, shredding with my toes out and be able to like, you know, get my feet out the board every now and again. Megan even went for a sesh and actually enjoyed it. Yeah. yeah. No, but it's super cool being able to switch it up, you know. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed enjoy tagging along for a pretty epic adventure halfway across the world. Uh, if you want to find out more info about the spot, stuff will probably be linked down in the description below. Or you can always shoot me an email via my website. Um, and that's pretty much it, Bruce. Big thanks for tuning in. Uh, stoked to share this stuff with you guys. Probably see you guys soon in another video. Peace, love, and Megan. See ya. Big ups. Big ups.